Hey guys, we're here at the fabulously trendy Fune restaurant in downtown Atlanta. That's right, we are here to give you a full Sushi 101 crash course. Now did you know, sushi did not originate in Japan. I did not know that. Where did it originate? It was actually introduced to Japan in the 7th century by China. Stick with us and let's roll. Let's roll. So we've got our sushi here in front of us in sort of a semi-formal place setting. What we're going to talk about is the four kinds of sushi. That's right. There's basically four types of common sushi. We've got the nigiri sushi, which is basically a pad of rice with uh, the raw fish on top. We've got the maki sushi, which is the cylinder cut uh, sushi. When people think of sushi, they think of maki sushi because it's the rice, you've got the seaweed, and the raw fish with the vegetables and whatnot inside of the roll. Now there's also Oshi Sushi, which is sushi that's got all the mixture and it's clamped down with a wooden block, then it's cut into rectangular form, and then it's served in bite-sized pieces. And then of course there's Chiliri, which is all the sushi stuff mixed into a bowl, it's a fun little dish. So let's get into the condiments of sushi and what you need to know about putting on your sushi to get the full flavor effect. Totally. So we've got the soy sauce, nice. which is a very, very um, important part of the sushi experience. We have got the wasabi, which is a light green Japanese root, which is powdered and turned into a paste like That's that. That's hot stuff right there. That is. I dare you to eat that whole thing. Don't try this at home. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Now that his uh, mouth is pretty hot and on fire, yeah. uh, he might need some ginger, Ooh. which is actually a cleansing palette for your mouth. So when you eat a bite of sushi or a certain roll and you want the flavor to kind of dissolve, it's just like yeah, eating a plain that. cracker to kind of get the let's, taste out of your let's, mouth. Let's get the taste of wasabi out of my mouth. Mm. Now this is a piece of nigiri and I'm going to give this to you. Cool. And I'm going to take a piece of the maki. How come you get the cool stuff and I get like the plain fish with That's rice? just as good. Yeah, Don't be right. fooled. Don't be fooled. Those of you that are on diets or worried about the calorie intake, do not worry because a typical serving of sushi is about seven to nine pieces and the calorie intake is about 300 to 450 calories, which is like nothing. Now let's get into some of the popular kinds of sushi okay. that everyone wants to talk about. California roll is one of the most popular rolls because it's avocado, imitation crab, or real crab, um, and uh, cucumber as well as avocado. And then we've got the Philadelphia roll, which is uh, cream cheese, scallions, and salmon, which is really cool. popular and really good. We've got spicy tuna and tuna roll. And if you are uh, scared of raw fish, don't worry because there are cucumber and avocado rolls that have no raw fish in it, that is basically just the rice with the nori, the dried seaweed, and the cucumber and the avocado inside of the roll. But there's nothing to be scared of. I'm gonna prove it right now. Check this out. This is raw fish. You forgot your wasabi. Uh, no, I did not. I had the wasabi. Here we go. Mmm. It's so good. Now we're just gonna get to eating and finishing our sushi. You guys get on. Yeah, uh, get out of here. Why not? We're eating. Hey guys. Let's go see what the chefs are up to. Come on. So this is Chef Jay. Jay, what are you gonna make for us today? Uh, today uh, we're gonna make um, a California roll, basically. And this is right, right here. Cool, that's that awesome. just happened. That's enough sushi for today. Come on. <laughs> Thank you guys for joining us on Crash Course. Hopefully by now, you guys are sushi experts. And don't forget, Crash Course begins with you. So send all your show topics to ideas at CrashCourseTV.com. I'm AJ Ward. And I'm Brittany Tenenbaum. And thank you guys for joining us today.